All right, so we're going to AetherHub, AetherHub.com. We're going to go to Apps, and we're going to look at the Hypergeometric Calculator. What's all that? That's just a fancy word for what's the chances of drawing a specific card in my deck. So by way of example, looking at the deck that we started off with, we had 63 cards. A lot of those cards, we only had two of. So what's our chance of drawing that card in our opening hand? 63 cards. We're going to pull seven cards in the opening hand. There's only two of said card in there. And what's our chance? We want to get at least one of those cards in our opening hand. The chances of getting one or more is only 21%. So by way of example, we're going to narrow that down to a 60 card pool. We're going to increase the card number to four and see what our chance goes to. Up to f almost 40% chance of drawing that card. Looking at that, we can see why it's important to make sure that we always have four of any given card in the deck if it's something that we need to draw early game. We can increase our sample size and uh, see if we only have two of those cards in there later on in the game after we've drawn maybe, let's see, where are we at here? We start with seven, we'll say four turns into the game. What are our chances? Our chance becomes 33%. A little bit better if it's a mid-game card. You've got to keep those numbers in mind. Looking at 40 card deck, sample size of 4, success is in the deck, you're going to want 4 of whatever card in there. When would you ever have more than that? So let's see what we do if we have eight. Well, if we are, say, playing a three CMC counter spell, we can certainly use, well, here's two cards on screen that you can see that uh, basically perform just about the same function. By doing that, we can increase and we can kind of figure out the numbers on our deck. Now, this isn't something you're going to go through for every single card in the deck, but it will help guide your decision and your decision making later on as you're putting cards together.